Hello everybody! Welcome to another Life is Strange with Brayden! <laughs> and today we'll be continuing Life is Strange. Last time we left off, I was like looking around and I don't remember if I was able to end it. But, um, yeah. So, here we are. Hard to believe Chloe was my BFF just five years ago. Let's hear that CD. So it was Chloe who printed all those flyers. Okay, you guys might have seen a lot of that before, but yeah, I haven't seen, like... Yeah. Okay. So I think we looked at this last. It won't play without any power. Yeah, so we still have to find it. Hey, that TV used to be in the living room. <sighs> yeah, that looked through here. I wonder what Chloe keeps in here. Look at that. Chloe and her dad were so close. Yep. So now... I'm not into them. Too pretentious. There's the power strip. Now I have the power. There's the power strip. I'm not into them. Too pretentious. Damn, Chloe does need a lot of money to get out of Arcadia. Damn, Chloe does need a lot of money to get out of Arcadia. I wonder what Chloe keeps in here. Old cardboard boxes. Oh, this is a flashback to youth. Our super secret closet lair. Chloe's dad built this dresser. Chloe totally changed. Okay. Now let's see what kind of music Chloe is into these days.
Anyway, you can find tools to fix your camera in the garage. Chloe, are you okay? Sure, I'm awesome. I just want to blaze and be alone for a moment. Okay, Chloe, a metal box under the bed equals secret. Hard to believe Chloe was my BFF just five years ago. Can you let me chillax for a bit? Alone? The tools are still downstairs. Chloe was always taller than me. We made her dad keep track of her height. Didn't expect anything this wistful from Chloe. Maybe it reminds her of Rachel. Man, I remember this furniture. We spent all day painting it blue. Chloe. We had such a blast drawing these together. You can't go home again, said Thomas Wolfe, but here I am. These books have not been touched since the last decade. I see why. This must be Chloe's parents' room. Man, I am nosy today. You've been resurrected, Birdie. Fly, be free. Act, react, or die. A 21st century survival guide. Whoa, apocalypse self-help. Dog tags, sweet. David Matson. Oh my, Chloe made this for Joyce on Mother's Day years ago. I see why she would keep it. Joyce still works at the diner, and Chloe's new dad is a security guard. <laughs> Uh-oh. Joyce looks happy. Chloe's stepdad might not be a douchebag after all. Uh-oh. The prices are late on their bills. Wow. It's just make sure there's nothing else. Uh-oh. The prices are late on their bills. Okay. So we can switch that off. Um. Joyce always loved her mail order catalogs of useless crap. Aww. Joyce has a little shrine to William. Her new husband may not be such a douche. Okay, everyone.
We're almost about like a minute to two minutes left. Dog tags, sweet. David Matson. Excuse me. <laughs> But, yeah. You've been resurrected, Birdie. Fly, be free. Back in there, just make sure we didn't miss anything. Oh, well, it looks all good. Okay, everyone, we're about almost out of time, so we're gonna go ahead and exit, and then that's where we'll end. Yeah. Okay, if you liked this video, please give it a like, subscribe, and comment down below. Okay, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!